the reincarnation curse. Lezard Valeth invoked this ancient spell by using a fragment of the Sorcerer's Stone as a catalyst. This man, who has been deemed a threat, is no doubt already reincarnated. Only where or when he has gone is unknown. Even with all my power, I cannot grasp his location. It is proof he has changed. Perhaps some of his traits, memories, or hopes are not the same. Or maybe all of them are different, and thus I cannot find him. When one is reborn, memories from the previous life are never retained. It can be said they are a new person. That is the providence of nature. If the curse follows these laws, then there is every possibility that Lezard is not who he used to be. He might not even be considered a threat that needs to be purified. But for Frey's prophecy, even now, she always looks so very grim. Lenneth, did you manage to detect the whereabouts of the sorcerer yet? No, I have not even been able to pick up any traces of his wicked essence. If you are not able to detect him, then perhaps he... I do not know how reincarnation spells work. Assuming he has been born again into this world. There is a chance he is now a completely different person. If that is the case, then we cannot touch him. Those with no sin should not be purified. This applies even if the individual concerned has carried out a lifetime's worth of crimes. Yes, indeed. It is as you say. Grim, you seem like you have something to say. I'd be lying if I said I understood all this stuff about dying and being reborn, but... Is it even possible to come back as a different person? I mean, I can't imagine what it would mean to be a me that isn't me. We, Valkyrie, cannot interfere with the providence of nature. While I am unable to speak of how exactly it works, I will say this. <laughs> Why are you laughing? You never change. In and out of lifetimes, you remain exactly the same. Lenneth, stop! That is absolutely not... <laughs> <laughs> What are you 
you on about? What do you know about me? Ah, uh, it seems I ruined the mood. My apologies. I did not mean to cause you hurt. Returning to the topic at hand, I believe we must move under the premise that Lazard has not changed. We best go to Midgard at once and search everywhere we can for him. But Freya, you don't even know where to start. We can begin at Lezard's old hideout. Perhaps we will find a few clues there. Hey, what about me? Ah, oh, that's right. I neglected to say this earlier. Hmm? What's that? It is good to see you again, Arngrim. Well, I remember nothing of our previous meetings. I remember, and must continue to for all our sakes. Arngrim, I sincerely hope you will fight alongside me once again. I guess I can tag along. I am counting on you. Now come, let us be off. A long time ago, a nation that gained great prosperity through their magic resided here. The power they had was far beyond even that of Vilnor or Flensburg. Huh. And they lived on this remote island? Yes, this used to be... <sighs> the lost city of Japan. This was once home to the most magnificent magic to have existed and the three mages. Had they not pushed their luck, they might still be here. Instead, they attempted to harness a power akin to the gods and invoked their wrath. Oh, how I want to know the history of this place and learn the secrets they kept hidden. So, essentially, you desire everything, Misty. It is only natural for a sorcerer, right? Hmm. I'm surprised you're not more interested by the prospects of this place. Interest requires conviction. I don't know why I became a sorcerer. Or why I want for power. Perhaps the answers lie locked away somewhere deep in my soul. I can only hope there is a reason for all this. The quest for knowledge and power requires no reason, does it? Do 
Yes, but the doubt that arises from these questions prevents me from becoming as invested in this as you, Misty. Or so I think. Your reservations are part of what endears you to me. Let's continue forging forward together and aim for greater heights. actually exists what is this device Misty do you know what this could possibly be in Japan they attempted to manipulate time to create eternal life and in turn an everlasting nation This device is a result of one of the many experiments they did. Manipulate time. This is a space-time teleportation device. It is the reason the gods descended upon and destroyed them. I wonder if it still works. Not that we should try to use it without doing careful research first. A space... time... teleportation device... Turning to me, I remember now. I am Lazard. Lazard Villeth. <gasps> Lazard, get a hold of yourself! Why I so wished to become a sorcerer. Why I wanted power. Every that was sealed away inside my soul. It's come back to me now. <laughs> come back? What has? Finally, finally it has happened. This device is my last hope. It will allow me to fight the gods on equal footing. Fight the gods? Lizard, what in the world are you saying? You cannot employ that device in such a careless manner. It's too dangerous. You will change the course of time and history. Besides, your body will be destroyed the moment you activate it. You cannot stop me. I now recall everything I so fiercely desired to accomplish in my past life. Don't worry about me, Misty. I relish the feeling of danger. Wh 
What? You cannot possibly be serious about making use of that device. What happened? It, it's like you're a totally different person. Please move out of the way. I do not have much time left. Goddesses will soon realize what has happened. When they do, they will come to destroy me. Just as they did to Pan. No, you will have to kill me first. I cannot allow you to commit such an atrocity. Misty. Regardless of what you meant to me, I will show you no mercy if you insist on standing in my way. Why? Why are you doing this? You aren't him. You cannot possibly be him. You are not the Lazard I know. where you're wrong. This is the true me. I have a mission to fulfill, and it does not matter who or what I must sacrifice to get there. I don't understand. Does that mean this whole time all this time, you've been deceiving me. I never deceived you, Misty. In many ways, I am still the man that loves... on time. You seem to always know where I am and how to find me. I'm honestly starting to wonder if some part of you doesn't long for me as well. So you've revealed your true colors. I cannot believe your desire for power is so strong that you would think to harm Mistina. You had best give up now. In your current state, it is impossible for you to amass enough strength to battle me. My dear Valkyrie, I have already won. It was indeed a very, very close match. What you're about to witness is going to be my true attempt to fight you. Hm. What tricks are you planning now? This time, I will not allow you to get away. You think I am going to escape? It is just as I suspected. You know nothing. Breathe your last, Lezard Valeth.
my device has activated? How? This cannot be. We are so close to defeating him. Dear Valkyrie, it appears the time for farewells is upon us. I shall travel to a place beyond the restraints of time. I will rewrite history, and upon our reunion, you shall finally be mine. How long I've waited for this moment. Right. History. What happened to the castle? Why are we outside? Such is the power of teleportation, Princess Alicia. Please forgive my crude way of handling things. I knew no other way of resolving the situation. Who are you? Lazard. Lazard Veleth. I have traveled long and far, through eons even, to reach the splendid kingdom of Depan. This is the place of the lauded three mages, whose knowledge I intend to make mine. Princess Alicia, I am so incredibly pleased to have made your acquaintance so quickly. Seems I was indeed born under a lucky star. The reincarnation curse. It allows one to retain the personality and memories from a past life, which disappear upon rebirth. To do so, an object is used to create an anchor. By tying your past memories and personality to it, one can eventually revive their old self. The lost city of Japan's space-time teleportation device, my trump card. I never thought I would need to employ it so soon. It is a testament to the power of those who are hunting me down.
and seek to destroy even the very essence of me. The gods and the power they hold are truly something to be feared. By that same token, however, they are also beings to be revered and adored. The knowledge lost with Japan is what all sorcerers seek to gain. It is what we were brought into this world to learn. I will be resurrected upon my return to Japan. For it is there that the key to unlock who I once was shall lay. I will take back everything stolen from me and sound the siren of my retaliation. With the ability to manipulate time, the power to recreate history as I wish will be mine. What does one call a deity that surpasses even the gods in strength? Is he too simply a god? on time. You seem to always know where I am and how to find me. I'm honestly starting to wonder if some part of you doesn't long for me as well. So you've revealed your true colors. I cannot believe your desire for power is so strong that you would think to harm Mistina. You had best give up now. In your current state, it is impossible for you to amass enough strength to battle me. My dear Valkyrie, I have already won. It was indeed a very, very close match. You want to use that device to move beyond the constraints of time. You are a fool to think I will allow you to take control of that thing and distort history. think you somehow learned of my plans. Well, it matters not. You are already too late. The device is about to activate. Lizard Belek, you will not be leaving this place alive. Say your final goodbyes. Your body, soul, and spirit are about to be purged from existence. Your sins are unforgivable. This is your end. At long last we've been reunited, my love. Respected 
little maiden Leneth, might you consider freeing the man that resides within you? Who are you? Jormungand. So, she has been awakened. But, perhaps not fully. There's no mistaking it. It belongs to my dearest Loki. Odin's seal is broken, my darling. It's been so long. Finally, I've been freed from my forced dormancy. This girl is Jormungand. The serpent deity? How is that possible? She is said to have perished at Odin's hand in a previous era. If you are still alive, then that means you must be the great evil that Frey refers to in her prophecies. Valkyrie Lana. I will give you the sorcerer in exchange for my beloved Loki. Do we have a deal? Huh. What are you saying? I will accept no such terms. Hand Lezard over to me this instant. I am, oh, so very sad to hear that. If you do not agree, then I have no choice but to grant the sorcerer the power to defy you. Then I will begin gathering strength. that I might soon return with full force. Wait! Loki, dearest, don't you worry. I promise I will do anything and everything it takes to save you. news. If we are to have even a hope of defeating her, we must round up all our forces. Lenneth, do you think you could begin gathering your Einherjar? If that is what it takes to save the world, then that is what I must do. God or human, it seems all we ever do is fight. Makes me wonder, wonder if we will ever find a way to attain peace. I am the one responsible for creating whatever Lazard has become and allowing events to unfold as they did. Until this is resolved, I would like to accompany you on your journey. Everything that happens is meant to be. 
fate holds no one responsible. You need not worry so much. In addition to everything else, we will no doubt also have to fight the Queen of Nivelheim, Hell. Fight Hell? But why? I can sense that some of our allies are trapped in Nivelheim. If we must enter the Underworld, then we will need Hrist's help to get there. Lenneth, you must be careful. We don't know when Jermungand will regain her power. Besides... I know. Alone, you will not be able to reach the farthest depths of the ocean where that monster's true body resides. Indeed, we will need Silmeria to lend us her strength. We are facing so many problems that I do not even know where we should begin. Loki, I need you to tell me. Do you think we have a chance of defeating the serpent that is Jormungand? Long ago, she was sealed away in the deepest reaches of the Midgard Sea by Odin. Even he feared the power she possessed. If she were to somehow reclaim them? The wrath of the seas will crash down upon the land, and the skies will tremble with rage. Midgard would be destroyed instantly. Perhaps you could win, but what you sought to protect would be devastated in the process. Would that still be a victory in your eyes? <laughs> and thus, I implore you once more. Lenneth, release me. I am your only hope. She will listen to no one else. That will never happen. You are far more dangerous than anything else in existence. The current circumstances do not change what you are. You seem to be under the belief that you know my true intentions. It matters not. You will have need for me eventually. Unless you finally unleash your powers of creation. <laughs>